Hey, it's Jude here, and today I'm going to be trying out this peel off black charcoal face mask thingamadoodle. And also, I'm going to give you a little bit of a glimpse into my new bedroom. I've been trying to put my life together and start collecting things that I can uh, take with me to Toronto when I move there. Hopefully, summer or end of summer, somewhere around that time when I get back from Japan. Hopefully, I have my top surgery. Yeah, so let me let me dive into this. Um, not sure if you guys can see. I'm kind of excited. It's for your pore care and clarify. Directions. Apply an adequate amount. Avoid sensitive eye area, eyebrows, hairline, and lips. Leave on for 15 minutes or until completely dry. Gently peel off mask from outer corner of chin upward and rinse off any remaining residue with water. Follow with moisturizer and use once or twice a week. So, see how she looks. This is fancy. Oh, it's, it's, it's in another. Thanks for uh, making more plastic for this planet. But, alright, whatever. Moving on. Oh, it's... I forgot to take off this. Remember to take it off. Oh, it is black. Let's see how this goes. All right, so the box says 15 minutes or until dry. See you in 15. Maybe it's backwards, 15, 15, 15, 15. So I said that I wanted to kind of share with you guys my room as this mask is drying. It's looking pretty dang good. But any whoozle, I got some new bed sheets and they're very pretty, that's all. I don't know why it's, if it's gonna focus or not. There we go. That's a mirror. I haven't put it up um, because I don't have a really place to put it yet. This is really messy stuff. Oh, don't look at that. There's a hanger with all my stuff. This I'm getting rid of and cleaning up. That's just holding a whole bunch of random pieces of clothing and random stuff. I have this, which is a 60 inch closet, all metal. So I'm gonna store a lot of clothes in that. And then I have a lot of hangers. I have my calendar that tells me everything I'm doing. I have all these hangers. I built this today. I built this whole thing today. And, oh, that's my stand where I film and everything. I built this thing today as well. So that's pretty cool if you can see that. Yeah. Jude's taking control and cleaning up. This this is not dirty clothes, this is clean. I just, it was on my bed and I, I didn't have time to hang it up before I filmed this video. Uh, oh, there's the light. I also made this, which is for my dirty laundry. Sorry, don't mind the stuff on the window. I got some new makeup and that's where the stuff is. I'm so in the midst of making and cleaning and putting away and um about that a lot more stuff is going to be coming up on my depop. If you guys are interested in a lot of my old clothes that you've seen in the last year or two on my Instagram most of that stuff is being cleared out and I'm going to sell it. So you guys should definitely go give me a follow if you like those outfits. Oh and I forgot to mention it's right behind me. This is a little tiny closet space. Let me open it up. And I wanted to, well, these are just empty boxes of stuff, but what I was thinking of doing is putting a mirror right here. So like a mirror with like the lights all around it and then having like a little table and then up the sides, I would take the clothes up, but I would have shelving up the sides for like wigs and my makeup and stuff. So I thought that would be a really good idea, but I don't know yet. Still working on it. Oh, these are my ash. Uh, <laughs> these are my assless chaps that I got at uh, Salvation Army. So you guys will be seeing those in the future. Oh, I forgot to tell you guys, I'm very under the weather. Some of you guys on Instagram might know that already, but I'm slowly getting over it. Hopefully, it will be done super soon. I don't really like being sick. I don't think anyone really likes being sick. Ooh, so I have a whole bunch of these to fill up. This. Let's go. It's looking pretty dry, but there's still some little damp places. Like over here is a little damp. I guess I did this side first, so. But yeah, no, I'm just kind of 
stepping into the role of being an adult and I'm going to the gym tomorrow morning for the first time in a long time. Maybe I'll start doing live videos on Instagram of me get getting ready with uh, other people because I think that the live thing on Instagram is a super cool way to connect with you guys in real time. So yeah, can I get a cool like... That was cool. Anyway, it's starting to kind of itch. The dry parts on my skin that are peeling. So it's from the bottom of the chin. Oh god. Oh my god. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Oh, it feels good though. It feels good. You know, I can understand people being all like, Oh, it hurts and you... But... Oh, it just... Pain is pleasure. And beauty. Beauty. I should have waited a little longer. Holy mother of pearl. Like all of my skin like Oh, look how clean my skin looks. Wow, this is amazing. Except for the black spots over here. All right, now it says just to use oh, a face cream. Skin code exclusive cellular cream. Just cause it looks nice and it feels good on my skin. And it gets that moisturized, so yeah. And uh, just, yeah. So to wash off any of the ex excess of black stuff. But I just kind of wiped it with my hand. So hopefully that is good enough. Alright, coming at your lab. It's Jude with uh, nice skin. Anyways, I didn't get the chance to show you all my cool mirrors. I kind of showed you the circle one. I have uh, three other ones that are really cool that I, that I got when I went to an antique store. So I'm sure I'm going to show off that stuff to you later. Funny thing is, is that you guys think I would have mirrors to take pictures everywhere and I don't. I had two crappy mirrors before that were, actually I stole one from my sister's bathroom just to do my makeup. And um, when me and Cody were dating near the end, like the last week we were dating, he broke, he punched and broke the mirror that I brought from my parents' house that burnt down. And he promised me he would buy me a brand new one that looked exactly like the one that he had. And he still hasn't done it. Um, still hasn't contacted me about it. And, um, yeah, we'll go more on that topic later. I have another video we, we should bring up with that. But anyways, I have some new mirrors that I can put up and decorate my room and hopefully move out of here soon anyways and take it all with me and move to Toronto to make a great life for myself. I'm just so excited. Everything is happening so fast and I'm so grateful. I, I keep saying this, but you guys are amazing. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm gonna be making a uh, another video about my top surgery because some of you guys don't understand and I just want to explain to you why and wow, I look really goofy. Please don't just, if I look goofy, just ignore this whole video, okay? But I think that's pretty much all I had. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed watching me put that mask on and take it off. Mm, I don't know. And I hope you enjoyed seeing what I'm kind of doing with my life right now. I will be making a mood kind of future life board. So that'll be hung up on my wall and there'll be more things cleaned out and, and fixed. So maybe I'll do an update once everything's clean for you guys if you would like to see that. But uh, if you guys like this video, please leave it a big thumbs up. Leave some comments down below for me to read. And if you guys haven't subscribed yet, subscribe already. I will see you next time. Bye!